Welcome back everybody to some more Fable Anniversary. How are you all doing? How is it going on this lovely, lovely Friday? It's quite cold here, weirdly. I mean, I know we just started off on a menu screen that was like snowing. Maybe that made me cold. I don't know. Oh, you can see our little horns. Look at our, look at our little horns on our character portrait. So, it says we're three and a half hours in. I've played for four hours, but I guess I restarted a few too many times. Uh, but yeah, we we did a lot last time. We we became evil -er -er. We got a giant sword that kills people quick. We got uh, three new magics. We got fireball, we got berserk, and we got uh, lifesteal, I think? I think we got lifesteal. I could be wrong. Let's check. Uh, no, I think that green one is lifesteal. And this one right there. Sweet. Is it nighttime or something? I guess it is. It's kind of dark, isn't it? Where did the roof go? I don't know. You're saying weird things to me, people. So, I think we're going to head to the guild and pick up the big quest line that we have to do. Everyone's just terrified of me. Brilliant. It's good. Uh, we should also pick up some, like, simple healing things. I don't know if we have even remotely enough money, though. <laughs> so this could be bad. Um, I don't think we do have enough money. If I click this, we will see we only have 353, which is probably not enough to get a lot. We only have one resurrection file and some food and things, so... We're gonna go in and do it, though. We're gonna go in and we're gonna do it. Heroes Guild. Here we go. So my day, my day has been pretty much like all the other days. I'm working on this um, short cinematic in Unreal Engine uh, that's almost ready to go. I want it to be finished by Monday, purely because of Sea of Thieves coming out on Tuesday. And then um, what comes out next Friday? That's bad that I... Oh, Nino Kuni 2. And then the following week, we've got Far Cry 5. Uh, so that those three games will carry me well into... In my personal playtime, not stream playtime. But they'll carry me way into April. And then God of War comes out. And... And Avengers Infinity War. Oh, that new trailer that dropped today. Oh, my God. We'll talk about it in a second. What is going on with my character's face? See that? Looks like he's got some sort of blue glowing tattoos on his face. I wonder if they're high level alignment things? He doesn't look super evil yet. But maybe maybe that's just how we look in the anniversary version? I don't know. Let me go over to stats. We're at minus 73. So I'm assuming we're on the, the third or second to last visual change. Who knows. Let's uh, Let's dive in. Let's do this. Find the bandit Ceres, and we have the hubcap. Oh, oh! Yeah, we'll do we'll do bandit Ceres first, and then we'll do hubcap straight after. This is going to be a a mission heavy one, and we're not going to boast either, because I don't think I can do this without taking a lot of damage. We might boast for the hubcap one because I'll buy some new items, um, but for this one, we're just going to take the quest, and we'll come back for the hubcap one later. I think we've also spent all of our skill points. Oh, no, we have 2,000, so we could increase a couple of things. I don't use accuracy much. Um, we will become more stealthy, making it harder. Well, that seems good for giving your skills to barter with traders. That seems good for 350. Okay. Let's also jump over to here. I don't think we can upgrade any of our new things yet. No. Nothing there yet. So maybe we'll just put some more in toughness, so the less damage we take from each blow. And we'll be left with 1-7. That's good. We'll, we'll hang on to that and we'll upgrade that with our other stuff when we come back. So we are now going to go head off and do this quest. But first, we should figure out where it is in the world. It's always a good Always a good thing to know. I actually don't know where it is. Oh, it's there. Twin Blades Camp. Do we go from Oakvale, I wonder? Hmm. Uh, 
Let's see. Let's see. Oakvale. Teleport. Now I've been I've been doing the stream for like seven minutes and I haven't checked to see if it's actually running okay. Oh, that's my voice. It's working. Hey, Irish, how's it going? I literally just picked up my phone to check, and I just saw your message in chat. How goes it? How goes it on this lovely, lovely Friday? End of the week, goodness. So, we're going to do the main story quest here, then do a, a side questy Hobbs Cave thing. Lots of battling, probably lots of death, because it's me playing the game. So this is where we spoke to Maze and he told us about the bandits. So we'll go this way. And head off and see what we can do. I so miss your stench of dead fish. I'm sorry, what? I so miss your stench of dead fish. Is there subtitles in this game? This game needs subtitles for stuff like that. No, there's not any subtitles. Oh no wait, I have them on already. So the random people we walk past telling about that she misses stenches of fish, they don't come up as subtitles. They would be amazing subtitles. Why, why, why did you never come back? No. Oh. Uh, yeah, it's going good too, Irish. Thank you very much. I um had a had a fairly relaxing day uh, working on this Unreal Engine cinematic I'm going to release next week. And uh, I'm preparing myself for a few weeks of constant gaming. Because I definitely, you know, those bandits to reach their camp. will be doing a lot of gaming soon. If any of them see you, they'll raise the alarm and lock the gate. And if that happens, you must stay hidden for a short time before the gates reopen. Can I not kill them all? Sneak past the bandits if you're seen. Kill the bandits and wait for the gates to reopen. I like this. I like that option. I don't feel like sneaking is going to be very. Look how slow we move. Jeez. So I am, yeah, pretty psyched for all these games that are coming out. I'll be probably, you definitely saw me, right? I am not this invisible. How, in what world did he not see me? I'm right in front of him. <laughs> what the f*** is going on? He's right behind me right now. <laughs> he had to be in my face, pretty much. All right, right, let's kill him. Wow, one hit killed. Okay, yeah, this sword is OP. Oh, holy shit. Oh, my God, we are just going to kick ass now. We have become OP. The Oest of Ps. I'm not happy about keeping getting goodness. We need to do some more evil things to add to our alignment change. So that we stop getting... Make sure he's gone away, they say. So, I'll be streaming like two hours a day next week, but I'll probably be gaming for about eight or nine hours a day next week because of how many games are coming out. Like, I'm going to cram Sea of Thieves in three days, and then I'm just going to rush through Nino Kuni 30 hours or so, and then get back to Sea of Thieves again, so... There he is! Don't open the gates yet! There he is! Don't open the gates yet! Alright, I'll go hide. They could spawn more bandits for me to fight. You know, that'd be fun. I'll hide behind this tree. With my multicolored arrows. Nothing will go wrong. I really wish we could just completely de-equip the bow. Maybe we can do that. Um, oh, right now it comes in handy for a few things, but I think later in the game I'm going to completely get rid of it because I don't even like having it on my back. It doesn't let me de-equip it. Um, but we'll try to maybe sell it, so then it doesn't appear on our body at some point. Oh, they're finally the opening it. Get more men out there! Get more men out there! The voice acting is still incredible. They won't see me. Nope. Nope, they don't see me. Oh no! Oh no! Ow. Well, how am I going to sneak past them? 
Uh, yeah, I understand that's the map. Look, this is my hiding spot. No problem, Irish. See you in a bit. Thank you, as always, for checking in. Where the hell's the guards? Get more men out How am I going to sneak past the guy that hangs back is my problem. He, like, these guys aren't so bad, although they are. there's three eyes on me, which is never good. He's right in front of me. Shut the gate. <laughs> this is going really well, yeah. Yeah, this is going perfectly. This is just what I planned. I mean, I'm getting a lot of points. Point thingies. Huh, I guess I'm going to have to wait for them to move a little bit. Can we not hide in a barrel? That'd be good. Alright, here's my new hiding spot. I call it Rocky. Rocky 5. Isn't that... Hasn't that movie been made? What was it called? I forgot what it was called. It had uh, Michael B. Jordan in it. Creed? Creed, right? I think that's what it was called. Where the hell's the guards? I'm tempted to just life steal these guys, but I guess once we get into the into the camp we can life steal properly and start getting our health back. That's the only thing I think that we might be able to get through this is um by using our new life steal. Yeah, Creed is a great film, I agree. I think Michael B. Jordan just as an actor is freaking incredible. I really feel bad that he had to be in that terrible Fantastic Four movie. But thank God he got to be in a good superhero film, Black Panther. He was so good in Black Panther. He's super underrated as well, in my opinion. Although I think he's getting a little bit more recognition now. But he's a fantastic actor. And just really, really good. Right, I think we've finally done it. We've sneakeded. We've snuck. We've 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 stealth stealthed. We've got stuck on a rock. Dwayne, we got stuck on Dwayne. There we go. Finally in the camp. Oh, I didn't know he was on Friday Night Lights. That's pretty cool. I've never seen Friday Night Lights, but I'm very aware of it and I've seen clips from it. Here, you were in Never actually just sat down and properly watched it though. No. What did the idiot do this time? He only lost his bloody cap in a raid. <sighs> It was a week before he could get back into the camp. Yeah, you can't get in unless you're in full gear these days. Oh no, we have to wear if bandit you ask gear. Me, old twin blades getting a bit jumpy. Don't know what's got into him. Hey, who's that? I'll tell you what show I've been watching recently. It got cancelled, but it's a little show called Selfie, with um, John Cho and Karen Gillan. Um. It's really good. Like, it's just a silly sitcom. But there's an episode. Episode 10 of season 1. I never got a season 2. Is one of my favorite recent sitcom episodes I've ever seen. It's a karaoke episode. And it's just... It's so good. And, I mean, I am slightly in love with Karen Gillan. So, you know. She was Amy Pond in Doctor Who. And then she's Nebula in uh, Guardians of the Galaxy. She's so good. I love her. Just a, Just a little bit, you know. It's one of those TV shows where if someone told me, oh yeah, a TV show called Selfie is really good, I would be like, ha, yeah, sure. Yeah, all right. I don't believe you. And it actually is. I'm trying to do lifesteal here, but I don't feel like we're getting, oh, much money for a book. So much for being powerful. Where's my chat gone? There we go. I'm just gonna life steal this guy. Hero, your will energy is low. What's that? There we go. 
bit of ranged action. Yeah, it's it's selfie. I think selfie might be the name, maybe one of the reasons why it got cancelled. It's a terrible, terrible name for a series. It has nothing really to do with selfies either. It's just, it's about social media a lot of the time, but it's not about selfies. Um, and I think um, the name probably really hurt. Which is a shame because. It's a really, really good show. Really, really good show. Well, it, it's not like Breaking Bad or Game of Thrones or, you know, like it's not high action, high budget. It's just really fun, silly sitcom. And I really enjoy it. I really enjoy it. I'm almost finished with it, actually. It's going to be sad because it's such an only a short series. Oh, run right away. Guy with a mace. This new sword is completely overpowered. Like, just completely overpowered. And we're just ripping through this bandit camp. Ripping through it. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, this is bad. How'd you like that? Yeah. Oh no, it's still alive. Nope, dead. Dead. And then what else have I been watching? Altered Carbon. Um. And that's about it. Uh, other than Annihilation the other night, I haven't really watched anything else recently. I rewatched The Last Jedi last weekend. Because uh, that's out digitally now. And I watched. Yeah. Finished something recently and I've forgotten what it is, which is not a good sign. If I've forgotten, I finished a series and I can't remember what it was. But a lot of the time, a lot of my media consumption while I'm like gaming or um, you know just enjoying myself, so to say, uh, you know, reading a book, I'll put YouTube on. If I'm eating, I'll put YouTube on. It's like back in the day, I used to use like TV as my kind of like time filler because I don't like doing one thing at once I always like to have something on um, but like I just got so much on YouTube to watch these days I watch a lot of science videos on YouTube I watch some gaming but not a lot a lot of like physics and uh, science theory videos I guess which is more like theoretical physics sort of videos Videos about the Fermi Paradox, things like that is kind of, you know, what I fill my time with. Other than that, podcasts, audiobooks. Because um, while I am an avid reader, I don't a lot have a lot of time to read because I like to game so much. So instead of, uh, especially on a game where you're just grinding, doing the same thing over and over and over again, I like to just put an audiobook on or a podcast or, you know, even YouTube just to the side of me on another screen. So do we have now the fun, fun, the full bandit outfit? We may do. Oops. Oops. We need a chicken. I ate chicken today. It was good. <laughs> I don't know why I said it like that. Uh, equipment. So if we go to outfits, bandit outfit. Yeah, five out of five. It makes us. Eviler and less attractive, but still scary. There we go. We banned it now. They'll probably think we're one of them. Hello. It's fine. Absolutely fine. Nothing bad happened at all. Come on. I, I honestly thought they were going to be friends with me now that I was wearing their outfit. I take way too much damage too quick.
I need to just stick back and use my spells, I think. Considering I'm using a stupidly powerful weapon, these guys don't seem to be dying as quickly as I would have liked. There we go. We got him. We got him. I think to get into the camp you need to be wearing this outfit. Oh no, there's one here. Get off me. Nope. Now, what is in here? We've already got all the bandit gear. Oh, a resurrection file. Sweet, we have two now. And what do you want, crazy door? Huh? Oh, you are not one of them, are you? My eyesight's not what it used to be. One was a gallant knight. His plate armor was so shiny. Probably what did my eyes in. Then there was an evil mage. The last was a rogue. Where is the gallant knight I await? So he wants someone in plate armor, I guess, to open his door? Like a full uh, heavy armor set, which is something I can't do yet. We'll probably spec out in full armor towards the end of the game, unless I go more of the... Um, high will damage uh, with the uh -oh, with the um, the robes and such. That's the word I was looking for. Hello, mate. Hello, Most mate. Gear. This here is Twin Blades Camp. Once you're in, you're in for good. Oh, it's got to be good. Oh no, good heavy. It can't be the dark red plate. Oh no. So. Feel free to get changed when you're inside. Another one coming in, Joe. Open. I think Joe's letting us in. Where's Joe? Joe. Hi, Joe. I really wanted. I really wanted to kill him. I re I'm temp. I'm so tempted. I mean, I'm pretty sure we die pretty quick in here, but I'm gonna at least put my Dark Will user's outfit back on. I think there's things you can do here. I think it's this is like a town. Hi. Hello. How's it going, fellas? All right. They're not scared of me. There seems to be is a bodyguard here. If you're looking for someone with real teeth. You won't find none sharper. I'll go find a shark, mate. Don't worry about it. Suit yourself. So I guess you can hire bodyguards? I don't remember that in this game. It has been many years, though. Psst. I've uh, heard you might be interested in procuring a camp pass. I mean, no, but sure. Well, I can get you one, but... A thousand gold? A thousand. Ah, well. I don't have a thousand gold. I'd rather kill you for it. How's that sound? Oh, we got a guy who plays. Did you play Twenty One? Ah, another. I haven't seen you around. Tell you what, if you can beat me at a game of Guess the Edition, you can have this spare pass. Come back and talk to me when you're. I don't know what game of edition is. He isn't playing blackjack. I only understand blackjack. It was. So the bodyguard, and that was it. I guess the bodyguard is if you choose to go full crazy in this place. Which I guess you could do if you really wanted to. We got some traders here. I think I am going to trade. And I'm not going to spend that thousand on that piece. I'm going to try to win the game of edition. Oh, I wonder if this guy will sell, buy my rubies off me. Nope. I don't think I can sell them. Oh, he'll buy the jet from me though. 
Yes. But uh, maybe if they sell Ruby and Sapphire, they'll buy it from me. Okay. What else you got? What else you got? I'm gonna buy two of these. One of these. And I think that's it. From this guy. Oh, a fishing rod would be good. I'm gonna pick one of those up. I've not used a spade in Fable 1 ever, I don't think. I know it's common in like Fable 2 with a dog. Eyes of a killer. This handbook gives you tips on making yourself scarier to other people, performing acts of great evil, having certain tattoos applied to your body, and mastering a really nasty laugh are all considered winners. I don't know how that will help. The Ugly Guide. Though admittedly writing for a small market, the author of this manual has many handy tips on making yourself less attractive. <laughs> oh, best-selling book. Oh, that's great. I might pick up the Eyes of a Killer before we leave. I'm just not willing to drop 200 right now. You won't catch many fish with swords and arrows, but use a rod over water and you'll be chocking on scales. Choking on scales. I thought it, said, I thought it was going to say, like, you'll be chocked full. So I read chocked instead of choking. Uh, so this guy has a bunch of... Ooh, he has obsidian long swords and stuff. Well, we have an obsidian... Great sword, so we're good. Yeah, this is the one we have right now. I think it was I think it's cheaper from this guy. I think we spent five thousand on it. Oh, it's because we're evil and in Barrowstone they don't like us, but because we're evil they like us here. We should have just bought it from here and saved two grand. Jesus. Different bows if we really wanted to. The crossbow is slightly more enticing to me than the uh, the bows. Uh, what else does he have? He also has a flame augmentation, which is a um, is a gem for the weapons. Next trader. Oh wow, these are the dark chain mail. So I'm guessing you were saying earlier that it's probably the white plate, like the the steel colored plate that you need. The dark chainmail looks so good. Oh, it looks so good. You can get dark villages, dark plate, dark leather. I can't remember which one we had now. Oh, but the dark stuff looks so much better. Look, it looks so much better. Who would be good when you can look so good? All right, we're gonna go play Game of Addiction. Oh, addition, sorry, not addiction. I have no idea how to play this, so here we go. Here we go. Want to play a spot the addiction? Yes, I do. Uh, betting. Uh, I'm going to just start my bet low, like I did when I was playing blackjack. Oh, okay. Okay, there's time counting up already. Uh, this. Oh, what? We lost. I get it now. I get it. I figured out how to play this game already. So, boot skull potion. I'm going to say it out loud. It'll make me remember better. So, obviously, the blossom tree. So, we've got wasp, mushrooms, fish, apple. So it's the dagger. Yep. Uh, wasp, skulls, troll head, or balverine head, apple potion. So the boot wasn't in that one. Okay. Next. Gravestone, wasp, hob, Mushrooms, troll head, book. 
Uh, the dagger wasn't in that one. Okay, doing well. Oh, target time is 35. Oh, that's not going to happen, game. Uh, I, I didn't see everything. I think it was the gravestone. I won! I did it in 34! I just sped up towards the end and we did it. You've won with a new best score. Press A to continue. You're the first bandit I've ever seen with the brains to beat my game. I had to do it In super fact, quick at the end. Are you sure you're even a bandit? Yeah, I'm a big bandit. Ah, oh, well, never mind. I said you would win my pass if you beat me. So here it is. Bandit camp pass. So I wonder, can we befriend the bandits in this section? I always remember there's a boss fight coming up, spoilers, and I always remember just nothing happening after this. Like, I think all I remember is we would kill everyone and we could never come back here. But this seems like a good place for an evil Fable character, and we've never I've never been an evil Fable character, so... We're going to oversave this. Okay. In we go. You got to have a pass to get in here. I got a pass, mate. Looks like a valid pass to me. In you go. Let him through. Let him through. I should never do accents. I should never, ever do accents. So now we're going to the elite camp. Which I'm sure they'll all just be able to notice that I'm a horrible not bandit. I'd like to be a bandit. I could totally be a bandit. Look, I can run through water like a bandit. That's what bandits do, right? Oh, another resurrection file. Hey, guys. I'm your bandit buddy. There's a lot of green dots for me to go check. Starting... Let's go to these guys up here first. What is happening here? Dr. Roderick. He deals with the scruffy public. I'm not scruffy or public. Ah, no one a priest. I notice you've been contemplating the gates into Twin Blades. Quarters. I haven't contemplated anything. I haven't even been there. Perhaps we could cause a diversion to draw out the reserve guards. The gate would be open for you then. Of course, such a risky endeavor would require. I like his blade. Generation. Whoa! No! It's a very fair oh, Two grand for an assassin to do some shit. Now I'm good. You're speaking to the wrong assassin. Talk to Roderick. These guys are cool. Like an assassin's guild or something. Or you could say a creed of assassins. What? I didn't say anything. I didn't make a bad joke. I'm talking about Ubisoft games. Far Cry 5. Is, uh, is shaping up to look pretty good. Although, some of the things I've read is people saying that it's very samey to the others. I've only played Far Cry 3. I played 1 and 2, and then I played 3, and then I didn't play Come to look at Twin 4 or Primal. So, I, And I'm kind of lame. yearning for a first-person open-world shooter at the moment. I just hope it's got like a crazy good story. That's what I want. Help. Let us out of here. Hello, ladies. How's it going? I think me helping you would be a good thing. I've had a look, yeah. And I've got the only key, so you ain't getting anything else. All right, no, it's fine. I don't. I'm not planning on it. Yeah, I mean, most uh, most Far Cry games are pretty buggy anyway. Um, and you know that's fine. But. I, the, the setting didn't really entice me with Far Cry 4. Uh, the Himalayas, I think it was, or something. It's just not really what I want to do. But Montana, that seems pretty cool. The boss told me to look after this area. He's having a party. And that includes not letting anyone through this door. Apart from the hostages providing the entertainment. And that's what I'm going to do. Got it? I wonder if I could have played... If I, if I was a female character, if I could have been one of the uh, hostages. And nothing over here. Okay, so I feel like we've talked to everyone. So I'm not sure how we're going to do this. 
I don't really want to pay the assassins two grand. That's expensive, and it's money I don't have. You should be. You were. All right, you've had your. And I've. All right, you've had. And I've got the own. I'm thinking I could do something with these. If I kill him, we could open this cage. Right? Is that a bad idea? This is gonna start a rampage now. Hello. I'm about to start a war. I'm very aware that I'm about to start a war. How did that not hit him? Oh god. Right, I don't think anyone else saw me. We're going doing a good deed as an evil person here. The one on the left looks like a low poly Alex Vance from Half-Life. See, now I think I'm just going to get a bunch of good points. Oh no! That worked as a distraction. Good. That worked. Everyone's probably going to hate me. But... That was cheaper than paying two grand to some assassins. I probably got way too many good points for that though. We need to do more evil. Well done. The gate is open. You can go to Twin Blades area now. Yep, that's where we're going. Is there actually is there a bed here? Any beds? It's kinda dark. Sweet, thanks. I'll sleep until the morning. Oh beautiful. We've slept. It's nice and colourful. Everything is going to be fine. Not going to be a terrible, terrible, terrible boss fight or anything now. Nope. I don't mean terrible as in bad. I just mean terrible as in I'm going to die a lot. Stand back, lads. Twinblade wants a word with this little hero. I'm not a hero. Don't call me a hero. Weirdly, there's a cloth texture in the background that's way higher resolution than anything else in this game. Draw your blade, kill puppet. Let's see what you're made of. Maybe it's only me who notices this kind of weird, high quality stuff. That cloth right there, the one with the bleeding eye on it, is super high quality. Look at it. Okay, yeah, we should not be messing around. Oh god. Oh god. Alright, fast. We're gonna berserk up. Okay. That went about as well as I thought it would. Oh! That was a good hit by him. Oh! Well, me hitting him like that doesn't help, does it? Oh, come on. That's cheap. I feel like none of my attacks are doing any damage to him. Oh, that was pretty good. So I can only do damage to him when he does his attack with both his swords.
I don't remember this fight being so annoying, but it's very annoying. Yeah, just like that. Move, 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 move! I don't know how he didn't hit me there. A berserk hit, right? There you are. What's wrong? Don't you recognize your own sister? Her past once again before her. Teresa's memories returned in a blaze of fire. Oakvale was burning. She watched in silence as the bandits tortured her mother, then turned to her with questions of the missing boy. She answered them only with a stare, and so their leader sliced out her eyes. The raiders took the boy's mother and left Teresa alone in the forest. There she crawled for three days, blind and desolate, until she was found by bandits, Twinblade and his men. She began a new life of servitude among their clan, But the bandit king sensed her exceptional strength and power of will and listened as she whispered dark prophetic truths in her sleep. Those who could never accept this small blind girl standing by their master's side did not last long. When they attacked, she killed them without mercy and without emotion. She's badass. For this was her place in the world now. She's Daredevil. She's this this world's version of Daredevil. Blind and badass. I've seen so many things. So much killing. So much dying. I've seen you, little brother. In a ring of sand and blood. An arena full of secrets. And I've seen the choice you'll have to make one day. Between the darkness and the light. Teresa! I'm sorry, Twinblade. Your path is alone now. All our paths are. But before I leave, brother, I have a present for you. For all the birthdays I've missed. A power that runs in our family. He finds you when you're sleeping and when the daylight fails. What are you waiting for? Finish it, or leave me alone. I'm dead anyway. I'm no one's king anymore. I wonder what the good or the bad choice here is, to kill him or not. I imagine to kill him would get us evil points? Oh god, oh god, oh Jesus. I'm hoping this is the evil way. Do your dumb attack again. That was good. Yeah, great game. Thanks. Thanks for that. Yeah, this is going just as I thought it would. Oh, God. Come on, game. Let me move. This game likes stun locking you into stupid situations. <laughs> oh, good. Yeah, perfect. See, I don't know if this is the good or the bad route I've chosen here to kill him. Is leaving him alive bad or is killing him bad? I don't know how the game logic works, because to me, killing... Well, I suppose he's a bandit king, so killing him would be a good thing. 
but killing anyone should be a, a bad thing. But, you know. See what we get. We got 120 renown. We didn't get any good or bad for it. Okay, that's not too bad. Let's see how our stats are, are laying out now. Wow, we've we've gained almost 10 alignment back towards the light. We need to become evil again. We need to go around killing traders for a while. <laughs> What was the power she gave us? Just a ton of skill points? 250 gold. Resurrection pile. Open your gold. I can't tell if these are explosive barrels or not. No, they're not. I guess that barrel is not breakable. Okay. Right, let's leave. I think this quest is done. Like, fully, fully done. Yeah, it seems like it. Maybe we need to exit the area? It still says the quest isn't finished. Oh, okay. We got the bandit seal, a lot of money, a lot of renowned, an avatar award which isn't going to be usable soon because Microsoft are about to bring out the new avatars. Okay, so we can leave, right? That was a very impressive victory. Let's go to the heroes guild. Is there anything? I don't think I want to buy anything else from um, Bowerstone right now, so we'll head off. Quests to do. So I think she gave us like, yeah, we have nearly 200. No, I can't read. We only have 20,000. Um, I really want to spend it on physique. I think we're going to do that. Grabbler's physique upgrade. And then I think I'm also going to upgrade my. F oh, we can't upgrade Fireball. I really want to upgrade Fireball. Maybe we upgrade Berserk? Yeah, maybe we do that. And then speed. And we could still do phys Oh no, we can't do that. That's way too expensive. Um, we could do health upgrade. I think that's pretty good. Good chunk of stuff. Check the good yeah, thanks. Check the guild. So we're going to do the Hob Cave, and then the Trader Massacre, and then kill all the guards and traders in Barrowfields. Yes! Yeah, that'll get me a lot of evil. Let's go do the Hob Cave first. An old woman in Greatwood says her grandson is missing. Can we kill her grandson? Sounds like a, that sounds good, right? <laughs> what are you, I'm just thinking like an evil person. What? That's just how evil people think. I'm an evil, I'm an evil Fable. What's the name of this character, right? Fable? Right, I'm not doing that. I'm not doing that. I'm not doing that. Kill the inhabitant of the cab. Okay, can someone, can someone explain that one to me? Do not allow the boy to be harmed. I think, I think this card right here is to kill the kid. Kill the inhabitant of the cave. 
Now, if the hobs inhabit the cave, the one inhabitant would be the person who isn't habitating it, right? Would be the boy. Kill the inhabitant of the cave. Is that logic right? Do you think that's sound logic? That I think the inhabitant is the kid? I might have to Google this. An inhabitant. Fable. Hob. Cave. Inhabitant. All boasts. Okay, Hob. Hob Cave Quest. There's nothing here about trivia. Uh, that's just boring trivia. Where's the boasts? Uh, boasts. Oh, it just says... It seems like you have to kill a nymph. <laughs> That's what it says online. It says if you do this, you have to kill a nymph. A maniac. Just a nymph. Alright, we've boasted. We'll kill a nymph. It's fine. We'll also eat. Right, you see all you, you, you terrible... Oh, wait. I want a hero title. Yeah, I, I want that. Malefic... Mal... Mal I, if I could pronounce it. Malefica Maleficus. It's not even going to be close to how you pronounce it. It looks like Maleficent. The word Maleficent, but I've never heard it end in, in C-U-S. Okay, I'm googling it. How to pronounce M yeah, that. What? That doesn't even make any sense. I've never I don't think I've ever heard that word before. Maleficus. Maleficus. Ma what a bonkers word that is. I like it, but it's bonkers. So I'm not going to keep it. Um, Saber, Pie Master, Arse Face. Beautiful. Rune Master, Ranger, Druid. I don't like really any of these but that one, but I don't know how to say it. Uh, Hood is quite good. Saber is quite good. None of these are kind of inhabiting my how I feel about my character, though. So. Yeah, they're going to call me Chicken Chase. So I'm just going to kill them all. I needed, I needed evil points. I needed evil points. I needed evil. There we go. Good. We got, we got the evil sorted. So we've done that. So we're gonna head to the hob cave now. Oh, maybe I can't kill these guys. Oh yeah, maybe we can't kill them because they need a mushroom, right? I think that's why. Uh, so we're gonna go to the hob cave, which is I think we might be able to teleport closer to it. If I remember correctly, it's just past. It's either right before the Great Wood Colors Cave or just after it. I think it's just after it. Rose Cottage, Great Wood Gorge, Great Wood Lake. We'll go one back from this Colors Gate and just check. But I think it's further on. I think it's nearer the Dark Wood. But hey, the, the quest marker will blink us gold in the direction we need to go. Uh, so it's... Oh, it is back. Interesting. Let me put the sword away. Yeah, it's this way. It's back in the gorge area. Anyone else ever think gorge was pronounced George when you were a kid? And that's why I thought it was called Curious Gorge. 
George, Gorge, no. Just me, just me, it's fine. This is the deal. You perform an act of great evil in my sight, and I'll pop open. How do I perform evil? I can show you some great evil, right? Here's an act of great evil. You ready for this door? <laughs> is that not is that not evil enough for you? How about this? Sneer, I'll sneer at you. Yeah. How about a fart? Any of those tickle your face? This, no, this no, 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 okay. Deal. None of those were evil enough for him. Maybe it's, I don't know where it's pointing me to right now. I'm worried because it's pointing me both ways. It's the slightly annoying thing about older games is that you can't quite figure out which quest it's telling you about. Huh. An old woman in Greatwood says her grandson is missing. Speak to the grandmother at Rose Cottage. Oh, we gotta go to Rose Cottage. So why am I going this way, game? Game? I asked you a question. So we have to follow the silver arrow. What is the gold arrow for, then? We have so many pointless quests. I wish we could make them not be trackable. Because I'm never going to do half of them. Because they're, you know, like I said, pointless. Like, who wants to do... What's one of these called? Book Collect Brilliant. Great. The sick chap. Yeah. Chapel of. Okay, we'll do that. We'll definitely do that. We have to make offerings to the Chapel of Scorn. Scorm. We'll do that at some point. For sure. Become the greatest evil. In we go. And we'll go pick some roses. Speak to the grandmother at the great the rose cottage in the great wood. What's this door want? I never open on a first date. My heart has been broken too many times before. Wow, TMI. I could only let someone who really loved me through. Really, TMI, Jesus. James, is that you? No. Oh, James is my grandson. You have to find hello, him. Hello, hello. He's the only relative I have left. Such a sweet, helpful boy. I don't know how I'd manage without him. Is she a I witch? I knew this would happen. He's gone back to those caves. I just know. He got quite a scare with the things he saw down there last time. I can tell you. But he did bring back some gold. Oh, and he found something else while he was there. I don't know what it's for, but it might be useful. Here. Please find him. I don't know what I would do if anything happened to him. So my plan is to kill her, kill the kid, kill all the whole, just kill everything. I don't know if that well, if that makes you pure evil or balanced. I can't, I, you, instead of just killing the evil things, you kill the good things too. Does that make you neutral or just super evil? That was a great debate. My day was pretty good. I think the highlight was the Avengers trailer. Which made me scream out loud. My The people who follow me on Snapchat got to witness me screaming pretty loudly at that trailer. Which I've now watched about six times. And it's very good. How was your day? How are all the things going? It's very cold and dark here. And I'm hoping that it doesn't snow tonight slash tomorrow. Even though it's meant to. Right, Hobbs quest line. Let's do this. I've sit up. I've sat up in my chair again. Oh, I booked tickets for Avengers today as well. Very exciting. I'm trapped in here. Hello. What's behind door number seven? Oh, there's going to be so much loading screens. Oh, I hate loading screens. 
Hello. 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 Okay. Right. You all of you, crazy little hobs, give me one second. Yeah. See, this is why I, what I mean by berserk. Just kicking ass. Yeah, I've just murdered all of these hobs. Holy shit. Yeah, okay. Berserk and this great sword is kind of a match made in heaven. Me and the lads were searching the caves for treasure. Legends say it's full of their stuff. Legends. Well protected too. They caught us and stuck us in cages. Been taking us away one by one ever since. I don't know what they did to the rest. But I heard screams that it chill your blood. But hey, less people, bigger share, right? <laughs> so, what you say we go looking together? Sure. Can't we go faster? These caves are filled with orbs. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll help the bandit out. Oh, maybe this will give me some more evil. And then I'll kill him and take his share of treasure. Eat up a little bit. We'll go back to the main chamber. Well, I think the one thing that with RPGs like Fable, you know, Elder Scrolls, any of them, I get really addicted to just going off the beaten path and just searching for all the cool things. They're definitely going to kill me at least once in this cave, though. Because there's so many of them. Our bandit friend's nearly dead. Bandit friend, we must save you. Bandit friend's dead. Bandit friend is definitely dead. Yep, he's dead. Ba I just got, I just got good points for not killing the bandit. Look, stop giving me good points. I'm sorry, bandit friend. I couldn't keep you alive. There's so many hobs. It's next to impossible. Right, into the next one we go. If we find another bandit in here, I'm going to tell him his other friend's still very much alive. I just couldn't get him out of his cage. He didn't die or anything. Oh! Nope! Nope, nope. They kind of remind me of the little minions in... Um, not minions, as in the animated creatures. The minions in um, Overlord. Oh, I love Overlord. I should replay Overlord at some point on stream. It's such a good game. Another kind of underappreciated game as well, I think. It controls a lot like a third person. Well, I guess it is that already. It just controls a lot like Pikmin, is what I was going to say. We don't have five silver keys game. We're not that cool. If I had more willpower, I would use Berserk in every single fight. But sometimes I'm just worried that it's going to run out. But we'll trigger it before this next fight here. Hero, you're... And by this one fight, I mean this one guy who's going to die real quick. Oh, there's more of them. I don't like that we're getting so many good points for doing this. Like, our alignment must be shifting closer and closer. I don't leave behind so much loot. I couldn't loot any of it. Uh, stats. 70. Oh, we're getting more evil. I couldn't loot, like, the chest because we didn't have enough keys for it. And uh, nothing else in there was lootable that I could see anyway. Unless the barrel was, but there's not always stuff in barrels, so it's kind of risky to even search for it. Some of the barrels drop gold and food, but, you know, it just takes up time. Oh, God. Oh, God, what have I walked in on? I've walked in on a hob orgy. Send help. Send help. No, 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 no. Kill the magic guy. Oh, did I not see their little... I thought I got all the little purses. I must have missed one. 
I usually do run and pick those up, the little gold pouches they drop. But I must have missed them in one of the rooms. My apologies, that is really annoying. See that, I should pick that one up. A horgy, a hob orgy. Yeah, I like that. What happens? It's gold. Another chest. More gold. Ooh, flame augmentation too. Weapon augmentations can be attached to some weapons to imbue them with special powers. To do this, select aug augmentable weapon in your inventory and then select the augmentation. Once attached, an augmentation cannot be removed. Each weapon has a limited number of slots for augmentations, so use them wisely. Okay. I don't know if our obsidian greatsword has that. Inflicts additional damage to creatures harmed by fire. By apply. Yes. Cool. Ho ho! We have a flaming greatsword, everybody. Now, if that isn't the coolest thing you've ever seen, then I don't know what is. Probably anything but that. But hey, let's not talk about that. I think that was the the door we needed the hexagonal key for. So I think we're in the main quest area now. Did they? I thought they did port Fable 3 for PC. I'm pretty sure I own Fable 3 on PC. I know 2 didn't ever happen. Fable 2. Let's check. Platform Xbox 360. Fable 3. I'm playing this on Xbox One X, so I'm going to be streaming Fable 2 and 3 as well. Yeah, yeah. Fable 3 came out for PC. Just Fable 2 never did. Fable 2 never did. Which is strange that they did 1 and 3 for PC, but they never released 2. Oh, here's the boy. Oh, and there's a... Is this the nymph? Or maniac? What do you want? With a terrifying voice. No, I want to kill you and the child. I want to kill everybody. Because this character is just murder all living things. Provide an alternative human. Nah, I'm good, thanks. I don't want to die. Oh no. Oh no. Where did she go? Can't ever lock onto her. Oh, oh, maybe, maybe, maybe we got it. Kill the boy! Let me kill the boy. I'm assuming it's more evil if we bring someone else, but I want to kill everyone, so I don't want to just sacrifice someone else. Okay, can we please, can we please stop with this fight right now? We nearly got her. Well, we'll again. No, 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 I'm gonna die. I'm, I'm nearly dead. Did we kill her? I think we killed her. Oh, kill the boy! Yeah, kill, kill, kill. Let me kill the boy, please, game. Kill the boy. Yeah, I'm aware that my health is critical. I've got miles for that. The game won't let me kill the boy. <laughs> I'm, I'm afraid I'm gonna get too many good points if I kill all the hobs before I kill the boy. Yeah, 
Yeah, boy. I kill everyone. Everyone dies in my fable. Everyone dies. What? What? Bullshit. <laughs> Absolute bullshit. You're telling me I've got to rescue this stupid little kid. I hear you, Gam. I don't like you, but I hear you. Skipping the scene. Skip the scene. I try taking her out as fast as I can. Oh, how did she dodge that? Come on, spawn again, spawn. Close. Go away from me, Hobbs. We got her. We got her. And I can't get this thing she dropped. Well, we got it. We got it. Nope. Right, we're going to ke keep the boy alive until we've handed the quest in. Then we're going to kill him. I'm probably definitely going to get good alignment for this, though. So we'll definitely have to go on a trade of murdering spree to bring our alignment back down. There was even a boast to kill the kid, though. Oh, good. So I don't know how we would have been able to do that without failing. Did he just go, Mummy? Oh, my... They don't stop spawning! I think I found a grind spot. Mom. He says. We done here? Nope. Literally, they aren't stopping spawning. Oh, good. Oh, good. Can we stop them spawning now? Nope. They, they've spawned again. It's a perpetual spawning of mobs. I mean, I could literally grind this for skill points, but they're not great. Oh, they've actually stopped now. They've actually stopped. I guess we're just going to get attacked by a million hobs now. I thought she was going to eat me. I'm going to eat you, kid, at the end of this mission. <laughs> They just spawn behind the kid. Oh my god. This is the most annoying quest ever. Stop spawning a million hobs. Good, I'm dead. Good. Good. A little hob killed me. You're now renowned enough to use the sexy hero pose. <laughs> I'm now renowned enough to use the sexy hero pose. Well known I'm now well known. For God's sake, stop spawning behind us. It's a cheap move game. Oh, Jesus, so many of them in this room now. All right, no, no, no. This is happening. Yep, this is happening. Bring it on. Oh, 
giant men now. Did you kill all the hobs? Yes. This place was full of them. I did kill them all. Finally, a room where they don't spawn behind us. I've just jinxed myself. I've just jinxed it. Oh god. Oh my god, up file again. This kid's dead. This kid is dead. Yeah, he's dead. I'm gonna have to restart again. But he's just getting swarmed. What am I supposed to do? There's so many of them. Right, I have one possible idea. Not a very good one, but it involves this. And it's not... Yeah, it's definitely not much of an idea, because it just involves me slashing a lot. Yeah, yeah, I'm aware. I'm aware, game. I got it. This is madness. This fight is insane right now. And there's even more of them on the map. Whew, okay. This is the definition of fetch quest. I'm fetching a child. Who's been attacked again from behind? How am I meant to keep an eye on moving forward if they keep spawning behind us? Come on, kid. Keep up. Let's go. Let's go. Come on, kid. See a green dot on the map. Is that it? I'm sure we have to keep him alive somehow. I'd never breathe fresh air again. Soon as this quest is done, he is dying. If he disappears, I will assume he is already dead. It's just through here. Yeah, I'm aware. I've been here before. Marriage is not something to be taken lightly. Yeah, no shit. Thanks for the Wait, tip, game. You're not gonna leave me with her, are you? You think the nymph was bad? My granny is worse. Well, good, we get to kill his nanny. Whose idea did you think it was to go into those caves in the first place? Well, I'm not standing for it much longer. Good camera first angle. Chance I'll get, I'm out of here. I'll have to pick up a few things first, though. I suppose you want your reward. Yeah, I do. Don't tell her what I said, though. Come on. Oh god, I'm gonna kill him and his nanny, and it's gonna be great. We're gonna we're gonna bathe in their blood. We made it. Go and see if Granny's there. Oh, thank you for what? I didn't say anything. Hero. We're not evil. Why did you just scream? James, come here and give your granny a hug. Right, this is how we're going to start this. 
Where did you just go? Come, come back. Kid? Kid! Oh, I swear. You. You. That's it. I'm angry. I've become the Hulk. We have given chase to the kid. If he's not in this next area, I'm going to be pissed. I don't know if the game can remember if an NPC goes through an area. That's not the kid. No. No. The kid survived. The first person to survive my wrath. I would say I'd murder everything that he holds dear, but he actually hates his nanny. Where is she? Hello. Yep, she's dead now. Got anything good in the book? Yeah, okay. Anything in here? Good. Good. A nice comfy bed. No, she's probably sleeping that. I'm sleeping it again. There we go. Morning. I will find that kid though. Which is the last thing I do. More gold. We have more gold than we know what to shake a stick at. No, nope, that's not the saying, Matt. Uh, I wonder how alignment's doing now. Stats. Minus 64. How have we become good again? Why, why and how have we become good again? I'm not happy about this. I'm going to go take the quest to murder lots of people. Trade a massacre. I'm gonna boast on this one. I'm not sure what I'm gonna boast yet, but I'm gonna boast something. Now, every time it's like, do the quest naked. No. Hey! Take no damage. That's not gonna happen. That's not gonna happen. Ensure the bandit doesn't know. That's not gonna happen. Complete the quest in under four minutes. I wager four hundred for a possible thousand. I think I can do it with Berserk, so I'm gonna take it. Just, you know, making sure my you know, making sure I'm, uh, you know, keeping up the evil. So if we head into the the wood woods, the wood woods, Edward Woodward, we will um, probably trigger the quest, the Great Wood, and then just run through trying to kill everyone as quickly as we can. Buy a house. That's not a bad idea. Right, there's a lot of red on our map right now. I don't know if we've started this quest yet either. Nope, don't care about you, nymph. Nymph. Nymph thing. I wish there was a way for it to just instantly let me attack. Not the scorpions. The trader. See, they, killing these guys just gives me good points. And I don't want good points. Yeah, we need to go this way. The 
spawning of many scorpions right now is very just disconcerting. It's the thing. The thing. I like that they give you the option of like kill everyone or let everyone live. Oh, okay. Yeah. I am playing with this guy today. That's how quick I kill him now. In berserk mode. I guess we still haven't started this quest yet. Where are we going? This this way? This way. Get off. Get off. Eat some ham. Hi merchant. Bye merchant. I hope I'm even going the right way. I could be going just the completely the wrong way. I feel like I'm going the wrong way at this point, so I'm going to check. Trader Massacre. Oh, it's in Barrow Fields. Kill all guards and traders in Barrow Fields. Wow. I didn't realize it was Barrow Fields. Can we just warp two Barrow Fields then? Oh, this is going to be madness. We have to berserk straight away just to clear out the initial riffraff. And then if we can get another berserk off with a will potion, it'll be good. You're here. About time to... I think we lost our horns because we became I'm slightly some good. Of the lads couldn't wait and got stuck in early. So let's hurry up and join them while there's still some traders left. Oh, and don't be taking no prisoners, because we've got enough of them already. Kill all the guards. Let's go. Man, I'm so excited. Killing traders is the best. Let's go. We got to kill 25 in four minutes. So I'm going to run across this bridge. Make sure Berserk's ready. It is. Here we go. Sixteen left alive. Murder. Murder! Oh, we just killed a bandit. Sorry, game. Are they angry with me now? I don't know. I don't know if all the bandits just turned on me too. left to kill. Still using the berserk. Oh god. Two minutes left to go. Seven left to kill. Five left to kill. Oh, I, I can now use the middle finger expression. I didn't know that was an expression. I thought it was an action, but okay. There we go. Look what we got here, lads. Found this one trying to sneak off into Oakvale. Why don't you do the honors, hero? Please don't kill me. I ain't done nothing. I have a family. I have a shop. Oh. Rip him up good, hero.
Or maybe we'll get our horns back now. That had to give us a lot of evil. A lot of evil. Well, the horns aren't there anymore, so I'm not ugly enough. Although, they're there on this screen. Oh, alignment is 89. I don't know why sometimes we have the hair and sometimes we don't as well. It's very strange. Okay, that's that quest done. Next... when it wishes to load. Man, I really don't miss loading screens. I really like games now where they do the loading screen at the very beginning and it's like a, maybe a minute long, but then you never see like another loading screen the entire game. So much better like that. So we have another 24,000 to spend. Can that get us fire? We can get fireball level three. This is what I've been waiting for. That's like we've spent everything <laughs> on that, but hey, I'm also going to grab toughness up to this level. And we can probably still get, no, we can't get health, but we can probably get maybe speed. So we've got more dexterity in melee combat. I don't know how, if that affects um, great swords much, but I'm still, you know, I'm still leveling it up a little bit. And I think we will eat some more food. We're going to end up getting real fat real soon. We've also, this is what we look like. I can't wait to get some tattoos and some new hairstyles going on. Because right now it's not great. Uh, and we need to go... Did you just say look at the lovely trees? Uh, alignment. Flamingo dance. Uh, here we go. I just accidentally used Berserk. Just a giant Hulk rampaging around. <laughs> there we go. So now we can middle finger. What? That isn't middle finger. Oi! That's middle finger. Beautiful. Hey you. Yeah you. I'm keeping you under surveillance. Brilliant. Oi. That's far too amusing. Can we zoom closer when he does it? Oi. Oh yeah, look at that. Oh yeah. Oh, that's a big middle finger, right? To planet Earth right there. Well, Albion, but you know. Can you imagine just walking around and see a guy do that? Just middle fingering the sky. Alright, we came here to speak to Maze. Uh, I don't know where he is. Maybe upstairs? Yep. Hello. So, you really found your sister? Yep. <laughs> I'd never have imagined her living among bandits. No. You've really come a long way these last few years, haven't you? People are starting to ask when they'll see you in the arena, out in Witchwood. But before you go wandering again, I've left a quest card of my own. A favor, if you will. An old friend of mine has gone missing. Calls himself the archaeologist. He may Not have the stumbled architect. onto something big. Perhaps big enough to put his life in danger. There's a rumor that he may be hiding somewhere in Witchwood. 
That is, if Which he isn't dead already. You can use a Cullis gate to get there. I only hope it isn't too late. So do we have to pick up that quest? Probably, You've right? received a new quest card. Yeah. So we'll pick up the quest and go to the Witchwood, and that'll be the last thing we do tonight, because it's probably going to take us the rest of the stream to do this. Yeah, I saved my sister. She's blind. Did that. Dunza with that. She kind of... She shot a green bolt at me and then ran away, though, so I don't know what's going on there. Trader rescue. No, that isn't what we want to do. So I guess we're just going to call this gate to the Witchwood? Yeah. Okay. Let's see what's going on in the Witchwood. <laughs> Nothing says hard, drunken, and mystical. Mystical. I almost said they're mysterious. Like a tattoo. You'll find tattooists all over the place. Thanks, game. Rumor has it that somewhere in the Witchwood there is a sword that only a true hero can acquire. Yeah, I don't think I can get that sword, right? Because I'm not a, a true hero. That is supposed to give spiritual strength. Be warned. Some gods can be fickle. You know, I'm not doing a very good job of finding the silver keys. That are meant to be hidden all over the place. And didn't do very well finding them whenever I played this game previously, either. Oh, hello. How's it going? You look fun. That went well. That went just how I wanted it to. Yep. Absolute perfection. Yeah, this is this is going very well right now. Oh my god. Yeah, this is going real well. Yep. Uh, I'm supposed to fight this thing how? Yeah, I'm hmm. I'm not really sure what I'm supposed to do here. I mean, I am, but I don't know how I'm going to do it. I feel like I need to be behind him like this and then hit him, but... Fireball level 2 is doing some good. Level 3 actually, I think. How am I going to kill this thing? It's like impossible.
thing we figured out is pattern. His pattern is it's an absolute idiot. Oh, come on. This is... I hate how the, the stones just track onto you. Like, even after you've rolled. It's so dumb. Because I can't roll straight after a roll, so there's no way to, like, constantly just keep... Unless you just block all of the attacks, but I don't think blocking is going to... Yeah, that ain't going to help. Please tell me he's dead. How is he not dead yet? Just throw a fire at him. Ridiculous. Dumb fight. Dumb, dumb, dumb fight. Never want to fight one of those things again. another one of these things. So we're still looking for a guy here, right? I'm waiting for a tattooist or a new barber. Change our style up a little bit. Oh, he's right here. Supposedly. Oh, it's this gate? I only open to those who know my name. If you know it, find and hit the magic stones to spell it out. Only one person knows my name, but I doubt you'll find him even at the Temple of Abo. Okay. Oddly specific. Solve the puzzle of the standing stones to open the door. Find the apple. Okay. So, have we got to go to the Temple of Evo to figure it out, or can we figure it out elsewhere? Or do we already know, and I didn't already know that we already knew? That's a sentence. Because these are the stones. Everything's about stones here. A giant stone man, a giant stone face, giant stones you gotta hit. We got some chainmail gauntlets. Let's go to the temple. See if there's a way here to find out how to spell his name. I'd love to see a barber who offered a beard or a mustache. Like what? So you get a load of hair and stick it on you? Need a good sword to fight beside you. No, I'm good, thanks, bodyguard. Welcome to the Temple of Light. This is where my people come to worship me. Perhaps you will join them. Their donations will ensure my continued blessings. What do they do? Those who bestow generous donations will be rewarded appropriately. You seem nice. Morality awaits. Yeah, I don't. I'm not gonna do the stuff for the you nice sort of fight god. You. Hello there. Are you interested in hearing the name of the demon door? Well, bloody hell! Yes, I am, sir. If you can give me something valuable, I might tell you it. Something red and shiny, for example. Oh, I have a ruby. Otherwise, you... here. I know the door's secret name. It's Hits. H I T S. 
fuck is wrong with that dude? Well, why is it called Hits? That isn't a name. It's an action. <laughs> and how do you spell out Hits on, on stones? I thought it would have been like left, right, center, down or something like that. I don't know. His name is Hits. I mean, it's not Lutz, but okay. Perfect. So you worked out my name. Big deal. In you go. Alright. Jeez. Talking about riddles, because this is kind of like a riddle door. More of them are more riddly than this. They just released all of the achievements for Sea of Thieves. All of the descriptions for the large majority of the achievements, anyway, are all riddles. All of them. So, you found me. That's just grand. If you can find me, so can they. I should never have started studying the. Why is his face so high quality than everyone else's right in the game? Jack was interested in them too. Yes, Jack of Blades. Look, I have no time to explain. You can read my journal if you want. I don't want it anymore. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'll be off. It's not safe for me here anymore. Thanks to you. Hmm, thanks. There's a 15 silver coins thing here. Oh, we got a howl tattoo. I still don't know where the tattooist is. Let's go right. I don't think there's anything else in here then. Nope. There's a chest. Train no Check the guild for more quests. Or another ruby. And there, okay. Let's go to Bowerstone, sell some stuff. See if we have any other things in Bowerstone. I wish there was a, a tattooist in Bowerstone. It's annoying that there isn't. It's very annoying. All I want to do is like make my guy super tattooed <laughs> for no reason. You won't even be able to see the tattoos because of all the armor. Maybe like you, we'll get a gnarly face tattoo like um, in The Hangover. That'll be good. I've got my eye on you. That was an odd sound. Wandering Traders is the most common one, but there's also a tattooist in Not Whole Gale next to the weapon salesman. Well I don't I guess I don't have Not Whole Gale yet. I don't know when you unlock that place. Hi. No violence, all right? I'm just gonna sleep. My lord, you're. Oh, I slept all the way until night. Good. <laughs> but what would the wandering trader be called a tattooist? Then I wonder. So we're definitely going to go for the buzz, I think. Because we had the normal haircut before, which increased our attractiveness and scariness. But I'm just going to lower the scariness for a little while, just purely to have the buzz. Okay. I, I regret everything. That was a bad choice. 
<laughs> that was a bad choice. Yeah, you fucked up my hair. Can we change it back, please? I don't think that's going to be very good. That makes us less scary. Bald makes us less scary, too. Alright, we're back to having our hair normal. <laughs> that was uh, the worst haircut I've ever seen on a character ever. I've seen that haircut work many times in real life. But not on this character, no. Uh, we need to see find the teacher because we have a bunch of books for him. Right. I come to my least favourite place and he isn't even here. I wanna go home. Show me now. Oh no. Here. I'll be off. <laughs> he sees me. I'm dead. Why? That's horrible. <laughs> teacher walks in while guy swears at his students. Hi, teacher. Today, yeah, I got books for you. The creatures of Albion. Why don't you stay and listen? No. Today. Oh God, no. no. I'm giving you the books no. for Please. no reason. You You're not even giving me money for them. Thank you, him. Please don't the read it out loud. No. Oh, good. It was a play, was it? Oh, where are you going? Just giving you a bunch of books. Right. Uh, oh, what a beach. Any right books? Here. Well, the Journal of Bloody no I think you get an achievement for getting 25 books to back to this guy. This is weird. It is weird. You, I agree. Do you have a d Both of you look at that. Arby's a odd. Ah, both of you look at Dead. that. A Jack Stevens. Do you, both of you look at that. A Jack. Okay, well, clearly he doesn't want our Jack Stevenson book. How much is this house? I don't know if I want to buy the one in Bowerstone, but. Huh. It's really cheap. But again, I don't know if I want to buy this one. I'm not sure Bowerstone's where I want to set up shop, so to say. I think um, there are much better places. There's a specific place I'm thinking of in my head, which I think we'll probably get to in the next stream. Hello, Taylor Swift. Don't mess with the goods. Called Chew. His name is Chew. And chainmail helmet. Uh, no, we don't want to buy the stuff from here. We want to sell stuff, don't we? Because we picked up a bunch of stuff we don't need. Yeah, like these. Even though he doesn't give us good deals. I just want to get rid of them. Okay. We have 23 grand saved up. I'm just going to hang on to it. Because I don't need anything else right now. But next time we'll progress a lot more. So... Uh, last time I talked about how I'd fixed all my 4K stuff. Because uh, I play this game in 4K, but you all see it in 1080. There's one bug that I can't fix until I do my new stream setup at the new house. And that one bug is this. Let me show you what it is. Ready for it? Now. Now, that one bug may not have even just happened. Because I, I was actually just switching down, so it may not have happened. Um, you may not have seen it. I just saw it. I don't know. Either way, the bug is where if I switch from my TV to the, um, the, the the game capture, there's an issue where it doesn't line up so that it thinks I've turned the stream off for some reason. Not for you guys, but locally. It's a really strange bug um, where it just stops sending the signal. It happens whenever I start streaming and then I just have to do one thing, like change the channel and then it fixes it but when i'm in the new stream setup um i'll have pc screen so i won't have to switch back to the pc to see it so the tv will always be at 4k because uh, right now i use the tv as both the game and the pc 
but I'll have monitors set up for, with the chat and ah, the streams set up and everything. An quest card the guild for you. Well, there's an important quest card, supposedly, so we'll do that next time. So thank you all so much for watching. I'll be back uh, next Monday, so a few days from now, with um, more Fable. Tomorrow we're going to be finishing Dead Space Extraction on the stream, and then, of course, I don't stream on Sundays. But lots of goodness. And then next week's going to be crazy. For me as a gamer, so many games coming out next week. And then the week after that, and then the month after that. It's mental. Mental. Anyway, thank you again so much for watching, and I'll see you all next time. Goodbye!